Hi sweeties! I was reading my comments yesterday and a few people suggested I posted a video talking about pastel golf essentials and the most important things you need to get started if that's your first time trying pastel golf fashion. I mean, who am I to film that? But this is just my experience and the things I noticed by following pastel golf blogs and wearing this fashion quite a lot. But of course it's all optional, you don't have to fit in exactly in a certain style. Wear it however you want and be creative with it. It. I'm just filming this because people are requesting it and they have curiosity about this style so here I am talking about pastel golf again <laughs> oh yeah before anything I'm gonna post a Q&A video really soon so if you want to leave some questions in the comments that would be really nice you can ask anything you want fashion stuff or even personal questions I don't mind ask away <laughs> also please subscribe because I post videos three times a week and also give this video a thumbs up because it really helps the channel I made a little list of things I notice when I look at pastel golf girls. So the number one thing I notice is of course the pastel hair. The most popular colors are pastel pink and purple and mint green because they are gorgeous colors let's be honest. <laughs> but of course you can still wear pastel golf fashion if you don't have pastel hair but if you want exactly that traditional pastel golf look maybe it would be good for you to buy a wig. Like me I have bright pink hair but I'm wearing this lilac wig. Second thing is the black lipstick. I love black lipstick, I think it's the most gorgeous thing ever. But I think any dark lipsticks are fine, actually. Maybe a very dark red as well looks really good. Or dark purple, especially. I think matte lipsticks usually look better. And the lipstick I'm wearing now is not matte. <laughs> but I wish it was. Number three, circle lenses. If you don't know what circle lenses are, they are these colorful lenses that make your eyes look bigger. They're not that necessary, but I think they bring the kawaii side of the pastel golf. I really like these ones, they are pink contact lenses. And me personally, I think circle lenses make any look better, even if it's a normal, not alternative look. Number four, I see so many girls wearing tattoo chokers like this one. I think that's a very tumblery thing from the 90s and it kind of comes from new golf fashion as well. Some people don't like them, think they're a bit tacky because they're plastic and from the 90s, but I love them. Number five, when I wear pastel golf clothes, I always like to wear some hair accessory because it makes the whole outfit complete. So some of the things that are popular are cat ears to make it more kawaii, <laughs> or beautiful flower crowns, ah, or even hats, but this one doesn't fit when I'm wearing this wig. <laughs> It looks like I have a giant head. Number six, when it's a bit cold, it's really nice if you can wear some nice jumpers, especially the long ones. There's that one that I see a lot with a bear. I'm gonna try to find some pictures to put it here. Or any black jumpers really look really good with the outfits. Number seven, there are many shoes you can wear that will look good, but my favorites that I think look really cute are creepers or any golf looking platforms in general or little shoes as well, the ones with spikes or even pastel ones as well, they look really nice. I can't really think of anything else now but I think those were the main characteristics of pastel golf but if you can think of anything else tell me in the comments. So I think I'm gonna end this video now because I'm so hungry and I want to get some pot noodles to eat. <laughs> Please follow me on the social media and thank you so much for watching, have a very very lovely day. Mm -hmm.